If a person in the situation where one feels compulsed or forced into breaking the fast, or when one breaks it out of ignorance of a ruling, is it permissible that this person should be breaking their fast in such conditions? As a rule, whether the fast breaks or not, or is it permissible? If someone is forced to break it out of ignorance, out of mistake, Allah says in the Quran, in Surah Nahl, chapter number 16, verse number 106, that after you have believed, and then if you go to unbelief, unless it is out of compulsion, that means even if you do shirk out of compulsion, as long as in your heart there is taqwa, fear of Allah, then it's permissible. So if someone forces you something which is not allowed and it breaks the fast, then you're not responsible for that. As far as the general ruling is concerned, our beloved Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, he said, it's mentioned in Ibn Majah, volume number 3, hadith number 2043, as well as 2045, he said that Allah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala has excused my ummah from mistakes, from forgetfulness, and from that which is forced on them. So besides force, even if it's a mistake, or if it is due to forgetfulness, Allah excuses that. And that's mentioned in the Quran, in Surah Ahzab, chapter number 33, verse number 5, that if you do it out of mistake, and don't intend doing it, then Allah will forgive you. And Allah also mentioned in Surah Baqarah, chapter number 2, verse number 286, where we pray to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, our Lord, please do not hold us responsible for our mistakes and forgetfulness. So basically, the things that break the fast, whether it be eating, drinking, intercourse, etc., all this, there are four criteria to be looked into. If it's done by force, under compulsion, then you're not responsible. If someone forces something on you, you aren't responsible. Allah will hold you responsible. Number two, if it is done out of mistake, for example, a person, he has suhur, and he thinks yet dawn hasn't come, and he continues eating. It's a mistake. The moment he realizes, he stops eating. So that's a mistake which Allah will forgive. Or someone does something out of forgetfulness, like a person eats or drinks water while fasting unintentionally, out of forgetfulness, then Allah forgives you, and the fast is valid. And the fourth thing is that if he does out of ignorance, because he was not aware of it. For example, if a person doesn't know that vomiting deliberately, vomiting intentionally breaks the fast, and because he has uneasiness and he puts a finger in his throat and vomits out, then it is out of ignorance of the ruling. Even that Allah will forgive, inshallah. So these four categories, because Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala does not want to overburden us, and a prophet said that if these are the case out of ignorance, out of mistake, out of forgetfulness, if someone has a compulsion, all these things, inshallah, Allah will forgive you. And that's the mercy of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala.